Hello guys, thanks for joining me for another video. So this video is going to be a little update on Safa International Zenic. Some of you might remember me joining up with them uh, last week. So let's go and have a look how the platform's doing. So here we are. Look, if you remember, I transferred 104.02 Litecoin, Litecoin um, from my Exodus wallet to here. They take, and when you obviously when you um, you buy your package, they take away one. No, they, they sorry, they, they give you a euro, and um, yeah, and obviously now where I purchased the minting hub, it's minus one hundred. So yeah, with with this these platforms, obviously you deposit and credit your account via the crypto currencies. So anyway, uh, let's go on up and have a quick look. So here's my Zenit coins that I've earned so far, which is 9.34094878. Which, when you look at it like that, it looks looks not too bad for a week. But when you come over to the dashboard and you see the monetary value <laughs> of 1.44 euros, it's not quite what I was expecting. I was actually expecting it to be a little bit more, but one thing I have noticed as well, the crypto market's been very down lately, and that's obviously taking its toll here. So you can see the Zenit coin is now worth $16, and it was at about $50, not $50, sorry, $0.16, cents, and it was at about $0.50. Cents. So yeah. Um, so once the consolidation period is over and Bitcoin gets a little bit of um, momentum again, it should sort of go up. Let's see if I can go back with this chart and have a look. And that's a trading chart. Um, quick look at this. So yeah, last week it would have probably been at, um, so what would the date been last week? 7th. Yeah, so it would, have, it would have been here. So yeah, it's around sort of like 26 cents then. So it has dropped, or 20, yeah, 20, sorry, 24 cents. So it has dropped quite a bit since last week. But yeah, I'm not, I'm not too worried at the moment. I know that it will turn around, and when it does, I will see a bit of an improved balance with the Zenit coins. Um, I've also heard that every so often they have a rewards pool which they splash out to all their members. So hopefully that will arrive soon as well so i think that's done monthly however i could be wrong so i'll keep you updated on that and what i'll do is i'll keep updating you on this on a weekly basis just so you can see how it's going but yeah at the moment there's there's not enough cent coins cent coins for me to either consider sending to my metamask wallet um especially with that value obviously you know there's fees as well so it's not really worth it just yet but i'll um just leave it, keep, let it keep growing, and yeah, sort of um, see what happens. Really, it's only a week in, and also the market is flatlining, so I'm not concerned. Um, I get more concerned when obviously it's a high paying interest and, and it, you can't withdraw. So um, yeah, with this, I'm absolutely fine with. So if you um, are thinking about like joining up to this platform. And you've watched the presentation which I added to the last video. Um, this is how you do it. Basically, you come to deposit, and you can deposit via Bitcoin, Bitcoin. Oh, sorry, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum, Eurocoin, or Litecoin. I went with Litecoin because it's you know a nice, cheaper way of sending it. The fees are cheaper, and um, it's just as good sometimes. So yeah, I went with Litecoin, and obviously. I sent through 104 euros um, and then what I did is from there obviously once the payment arrived you basically come into your dashboard and you'll see the, uh, the pay, payout now no the payout now sorry you come to your account well anyway it shows that you've got 100 um, 100 euros in the account and then what you do is you come down to here which is shop and you know you might want to put more than 100 euros in but 
I'm very skeptical. I've been burnt quite a few times, and yeah, I'm I'm very skeptical about what I buy into now and what I'm jumping on because, as we all know, with a lot of my previous videos, that I've basically just been talking about how much money I've lost. So, yeah, sort of with this one, I want to hopefully make some money from it and show my progress with it rather than just moaning about lost money. Um, so yeah, um, obviously, if you are going to come into this platform, remember, always use money that you can afford to lose. Think of it as like a casino. And once you've deposited to that casino, you you probably won't see that money again. And if you do, you know, um, then it's a bonus. But that's the way I like to think about it. And then, you know, you don't have the worries then of like thinking, oh no, what have I done? Blah blah blah. And you know. I don't have to remortgage the house and stuff like that and buy new, you know, sell the car and everything like that. So, yeah, we don't want any of that. So, as like I said, I'm not a financial advisor. I've got no hidden knowledge or secret investing tips. I just like to look out for platforms, which I think have got a little bit of potential of making me some sort of return. So, um, so yeah, and then what you'll see, I'll see what you do is you click on, um, once your money's come through, you click on whatever... Um, package you want to buy you know I went for the 100 euros and with that you have to come down to 1 to 32 you, know, you can go for 150 euros or you can go for 250 euros um, but I've kept it nice and simple kept it nice and cheap and gone for the lowest possible purchase and then I think obviously going the lowest possible per purchase is a good way of showing everyone an accurate um, detail and accurate information of how it's going on a daily basis, on a weekly basis within this platform. So yeah, if you are thinking about depositing, um, bear in mind you'll need some sort of crypto wallet or a crypto exchange that you can exchange the money to and from the platform and obviously once once you have um, bought your package then what you can do is you can go to um, when once you started earning rewards you go to withdraw Zenic and let's have a little peek so uh, so look I, I would go from there because that's the minting hub that I've got look. and Zenic coin and then the amount so I could go. Obviously, there's one percent cost on it, which isn't too bad, I guess. Um, but when you've only got one euro, oh, so the minimum is twenty. That's interesting to know. So um, yeah, the minimum amount you can withdraw Ruzenic coin is twenty. So um, yeah, if things can, things keep going the way they they have been already. Then it's going to be about twenty week before I can withdraw any money. But it's all good. This company itself looks like they've got some great potential. So I'm willing to risk, you know, the money I've put in. Um, you know, let's be honest. If you were with a bank right now, would you be getting interest like that? No. Would you be moaning about it? No, because you're probably saying, I've got savings. So that's the way I'm looking at it. It's going to be better than the bank. And once this price of the Zenit coin does go up, then we will start seeing some extremely good, healthy balance. Well, hopefully. Um, but yeah, either way, I'm going to be updating you on a weekly basis. So I'm going to give you my honest opinion on um, how I feel it's going for me. You know, I, I know a few people that I've spoke to about this platform, and they they've gone in with a lot more money, um, so their daily rewards have been a lot better. I am hoping soon that I'll receive some of these profit pool rewards, which I've been hearing about, uh, which you probably would have heard in the presentation. I'm hoping that relates to the partial minting hub hopefully um it didn't say any information that you don't receive it so hopefully that will be the case there should be like a little information tab on here so you can have a little bit of a read up but it's nothing it just gives that little brief bit partial hardware processor partial master node full master node but it doesn't state you know what you're missing or what you're not getting but i guess that's part of the fun and part of the journey but anyway, guys, um, yeah, thanks again for um, joining me on this video. 
any questions just put them in the comments and um yeah i will get back to you as soon as possible but anyway take care guys have a lovely week and i will catch you all soon